Hello, my name is Wayne Turetsky. I am the director of the Fetal Cardiology Program at Children's Hospital Boston in the Department of Cardiology. And today I'm going to explain to you about the heart defect hypoplastic left heart syndrome. The main problem with hypoplastic left heart is that the babies are not able to get enough blood flowing to their body. In these two images, we see a normal heart and on the right here we see a heart with hypoplastic left heart syndrome. You can see immediately the difference between the two hearts in that the left ventricle in the hypoplastic left heart is very small and will be non-functional. In hypoplastic left heart syndrome, just like in a normal heart, the oxygen poor blood returns from the great veins of the body to the right atrium, the right ventricle, and gets pumped out to the lungs. When the oxygen-rich blood returns from the lungs, it can no longer enter the small ventricle. That blood has to be redirected through a hole in the atrial septum called an ASD or atrial septal defect. That oxygenated or pink blood then mixes with the deoxygenated or oxygen-poor blood, enters the right atrium and right ventricle, and then goes back to the body and to the lungs.